Hi there, it's Suzanne from sunstampin.com. I'm a Stampin' Up! demonstrator in Canada, and this how-to video is a tutorial for all my amazing customers who shop with me this month. This card kit will be sent to those customers who use the designated host code. When customers shop with me, they instantly get invited to a VIP Facebook group called Sun Social, where they'll receive extra special treatment. If you're not one of my customers, please enjoy this free video as an inspirational tutorial. And I would love to see you like, subscribe, and share. For this month's card kit, I'm featuring the Bloom and Grow stamp set. I have an online class going on right now, so I always like to support my online classes with my card kits. All right, so I have some Mosaic Mood Designer Series paper here, and it is cut specifically to go to be matted on either side of this crushed curry piece. Now, uh, everybody's going to get different designer series paper, like the patterns and stuff. They're going to be similar, but so I'm taking my very vanilla card base here and I've scored it in half and then I've scored the side back on itself. It's a fun fold, kind of a fun fold, nothing too complicated. So I have put the adhesive on the foldy bit rather than on the part I want to stick just so that I don't stick the card together because I'm a little bit of a klutz and I probably would do that if I didn't do it this way and it opens like that it's fun hey so I have a two inch circle here and it is also a very vanilla regular and I'm going to adhere that cattywampus on another two inch circle. So just offset a little bit. I'm putting three dimensionals on the back of my sentiment piece and adhering that, like I said, just a little bit off. And then I'm also kind of feeling where the dimensionals are and I'm stacking my uh, second set of dimensionals on there. And that just gets placed right in the center of the card front. So, you know, so it looks like a regular card until you go to open it and then it's not so much. So I have this uh, 3H crinkled seam binding ribbon here, but uh, depending on how many people shop with me this month, they may get a different color. Um, or they might get something completely different. <laughs> something that will go though, I promise. I won't ruin the design uh, because of that little piece of ribbon. Uh, in other words, I'm running shy of this crinkle seam binding ribbon. Anyway, that is the card kit for this month. Thank you so much for shopping with me. Stay tuned for a peek at some of the online classes I have going this month. Hey, thanks for sticking around to the end of the video. On screen are two more videos for inspiration. Click on the maple leaf for my blog or click on me to subscribe to my channel. Thanks again for watching.